Harry Mitchell. Jordan Midler. Welcome to the world of Chicory. Now, first of all, I'd like you to have a look at uh, Pizza, who is my... Person. Look at this. <laughs> Mine's called my Pasta. <laughs> <laughs> um, at the start of the game, it asks you what your favourite food is, so that's a, a wee insight in there. Yeah, um, this, uh, this is the... This is the game where you you have a paintbrush and you you paint the world. I think it is very cute. I think all the interactions I've had with the characters thus far, this is like fifteen minutes, twenty minutes in, are fantastic. Um, you've played. I don't. I've, have we I've, even I've, actually spoken about this? How much more of this have you played? I've played me? a few chapters of this, so I've been playing it on. I got it for review on PC, but I couldn't end up. One of the things we couldn't end up just finishing it in time which is unfortunate, but I actually also got it on PS5, and it's very good on PS5, which is what we're playing on now, right? Yes. Yes, um, this is the PS5 version. And I can honestly, it just gets better from here, because they just introduce more drawing mechanics, more puzzle mechanics, more ways to interact with the world. Like, you can draw in certain shapes, you can draw in certain brush styles. There are just more cute pu mechanics within dark space, things like that. Um, but beyond that, it's just a good adventure game, I think. You have no. these kind of classic Zelda zones where you go from yeah, North Sea Fox I got that vibe. Um, and you're just doing little quests, people. And now, where am I going? Where are you going? Uh, well, I actually, have to go, I have to go to. It told me to go to the the, the slippery woods, and then the supper woods, I so, believe. So when you get stuck, you can phone your parents for you a can. hint. And you can. Um, I did that, but the hint they gave me was not helpful because it told me to erase the trees. But when I do that, they don't seem to actually disappear. Hmm, you can't you, you can't really do that yet. It's probably talking about the other puzzle trees. Um, you don't have a map either yet. You actually get a map at some point. How about you head up for me? Okay. I'm trying to remember the, the the hometown layout. Uh, can you go Can you go right and see if there's yeah? Cause so over this way these, is these the, are, the cave. These are those are locked off for me even now. Even like a, filter, a little bit of chapter in. Um, ah, okay. Can you, so can you go through there and up? I think there's a way to get round to. Have you met that character down there yet? No, I have not. Okay. Well, there's a way okay. to go up um, ah, and around. Ah, yes. Yeah, there we go. So so that's one example of you can erase things to make them flower and, and call them in to make them go. And there are things that make you feel drop. Got a gift. Hell yeah. Beanie. You got a beanie. Yes. And you can, of course, stylize your character as you go along. So here's one version. See, so now you, so now you, you, you erase those to get past, but now you can pass them along. So Clever. Kind of verticality, you can get along. And now we're meeting. Is this money person? This is this is Blackberry, I believe. So the checkery of the name is the person that that held this brush, and you kind of wake up, and you're dusting her room. By the way, see when you were dusting her room, did you do all of it? I think I did, yeah. Yeah, I did. I, did, I didn't leave the room, even though it lets you. I thought I'd get mm. a trophy for it, but I did not. Yeah, well, that's kind of the rest of this game. Like you can go through and just color a couple of things, but you'll find yourself just stopping and just spending time coloring the world in a little bit like it just it's just very satisfying um have you discovered that if you hold down on a certain spot it like expands the paint if you keep holding it down does it do it like, like hold down in one place there you go oh. so that's where you kind of like fill a big chunk in which is yes. like cause i really like just filling in the ground just really just to start off with um that is nice it and reminds me of, um, you know, when you're like really young and you first discover Microsoft Paint and you just make everything one yeah. color and then do it again. That I've actually been playing, on. I've been playing the co-op mode with my partner on PS5 and it uses like the, the kind of the touchpad on the PS5 controller and it works kind of like the Mario Galaxy does where you've got, they don't really play any character, they just play as like one of the paint brushes. Ah, okay. So they can kind of so like like they kind of color stuff in and help with the puzzles while you traverse around um and that's very cute as well because you can kind of color things in together uh it's a cute date game um okay where are we off so let's now? let's let let's let jordan let's let jordan figure this out these are little jump pads that you can go on and you can oh is it just is it just wanting to and you can kind of and you can choose which direction you go in nice but you nice. can't get to that one yet not bothered mate not bothered. No, don't want the gift. But yeah, as as you go more on, in the true adventure made game fashion, which is quite a lot of adventure. We I was told by the publishers that this is at least fifteen hours to, to and you can go yeah. up, to, up to thirty hours if you wanted to just do everything. Um and you know, if you spend ages painting in all the worlds, you know. You can rush through this game or you can take your proper time with it. It's got that expandability. And 
We've not seen many, but the char all the characters are very charming, as you've probably found. I met a character called Lemon that was um, wanting me to repaint her house, and then when I did it, she was like, nope, I'd thanks, but that's not actually how it I was painted. I think I, I talked like, about you just, it. Could you just tell me? Could you just tell me? <laughs> yeah, I think I talked about it on the podcast, but the one thing that I like, because I put the demo for this back in Ludonaricon, and one of the things I liked about this was that you're just kind of, because it's not a very advanced painting, you're just kind of colouring in very awkwardly, you're kind of a shit painter no matter what. Yeah. <laughs> so, and, I, and all the reactions are like, oh, that's nice. Uh, it's different. It's certainly different. But at the Look, same I'm time... I'm sorry, I haven't trained my entire dog no, life to, no. to be a painter. But at the same time, like, they don't make you feel like shit about it. Like, there's a scene that up, up, comes up when you join an art class of people who are like, oh my god, it's the, it's the new wielder. You're like a legend. You must be the greatest painter ever. And you, you shit yourself because you think everyone you're a fraud. <laughs> and you paint like this horrific painting. Me and me and Blair did it of like this, uh, Blair drew a dick, I drew like a bunch of stars on of a page. You did. And they all look at it like, that's amazing. How did you do that? And like, I don't know, it's just natural, mate. It's natural. So like I have resisted the human urge to to draw a dick as as yet. Have you clicked in the right stick and and tried to be a little more uh, detailed. Oh yeah, zoom, zoom in a wee so bit, give it a wee bit. Of... You can change your brush size and like go really detailed for certain things. Finesse. Do you get so, more colors? You do. So that's a, another part, great part of Chicory I like, or Chicory. Uh, each zone has a different kind of color scheme. Ah. So you'll notice that I think, I believe at the at where you were originally, you won't have these kind of warm orange, yellows and purple. Yeah. It, it, it was like kind of cyan and green and things like that. So you'll notice like you have a different scheme for each area to kind of uh, a bit of progression and a bit of figuring out where you are and a fact that I, you won't see for a little while but eventually you get a, a a map and on the map it shows you all of the things you've colored in like worldwide you can see all of everything you've colored in each zone um and it looks very nice oh there's a big scary tree Definitely. I enjoyed I enjoyed this. Yeah, the, the time lapse thing. You can you can make like in the PC version you can actually make gifs. So oh, there's, there's cool. a time lapse, so you'll you'll do that time lapse and it'll go with like save a gif version of it, which is just like a publisher's dream for marketing. Hi Blackberry. Finally made it, it was only five minutes ago. <laughs> they were testing us. So this is the this is the person that trained Chicory before. They're the original wielder and Chicory's the apprentice. And they're a bit mean. What happened to my friends? So it looks like colors? Professor McGonagall. Yeah, it has that kind of vibes. Bye bye. <laughs> Probably. And everyone's worried about spoilers. There isn't really. You don't really find out anything. It's a very mysterious story. You don't really know what's happening. So. Jesus Christ. So this 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 is a boss. You've got to try and color. This is like an animation you'd see in primary school to learn <laughs> French. <laughs> yeah, it's got kind of Undertale vibes. These dark sections. You gotta try and get all the things. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's bullet hell. This is Returnal. I thought this was just gonna be a casual, <laughs> like, mess about just, game. Ju just play it better. It's war, mate. What do you mean? How do I strafe? <laughs> how do I dodge? How do, how do I phantom dodge? <laughs> but yeah, I've got. I've been playing this and Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart uh, alternating. And honestly, what a great time I've been having in PS5. Yeah, like, games have just kind of came out. Like, it was, it was a bit of a no. sneaky one, but. They, they released video games. As a publication that started in January or February, we were like, oh, yeah, this is okay, I guess. Now there are proper games coming out, real games. But um, yeah, you, we, we talked about it a little bit on the podcast and when Lunaricon was happening, but when you get a game like this that comes out, it's like, oh, you can draw in the world. Like, we've kind of seen that before, uh, and it just seems like a gimmick that I wouldn't really be interested in. But It made me think of Epic Mackey, like, yeah, at the start. And also Drawn for Life was a, a one that yeah. I liked on DS um, when I was younger. And also, uh, there are tons of games doing this whole Animal Crossing, cutesy, charming, an everyone's an animal thing. But when it's written really well, and, and really honestly and, and genuinely like this, I think, it's, I think it's just hard not to like it. Also, the, the music is made by people who make Minecraft, so like, fucking, what's not to love? Yeah, I, 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 it, is, it is very, very good. And you can tell oh, it's not, it's not, a, it's, true, right? it's not an overbearing soundtrack, but it's just a very chill, enjoyable soundtrack. That you can do it. You can mug this big eye in. 
I love hard. Oh, yeah. I love yeah. <laughs> I'm very good at games. I know it is difficult to play games and talk at the same time, but um, I, I beat the last boss in Returnal in one try, so I'm basically the best gamer just, yeah. that ever were. I like how bosses like that look like it's an MS Paint, but everything else is like drawn quite well. Yeah. So now we're in chapter two, a wielder's duty. Uh, oh, oh. You're gonna, oh, oh. you're gonna, you're gonna let me game. There we game, go. Game. Um, and as you move on, you're gonna gradually pick up little things. Hi, Blackberry. We painted your house, by the way. <laughs> what have you done to my floors? <laughs> oh, a corruption. Yeah, similarly to John for Life, it's like there's this black mass that's kind of spreading and corrupting everything. Um, <laughs> you're a, you're a Chicory stan. Anytime anyone are... speaks badly of Chicory, yeah, we are crazy. we are Chicory's number one fan. And you will actually meet Chicory soon. Um, and it's a bit like meeting new heroes, you know? Yeah. Chikori's like when I met CM Punk. <laughs> it was actually very nice. He has a reputation for being horrible to fans. It was it's, like, nice. it's like when he met when he met um, number one fan of Chicory in a spar. <laughs> Wherever his name is. Shuhi Yoshida. There you go. <laughs> Funnily enough, when I met him in that uh, RS McCall's about eight years ago, he said to me, you should, RS McCall, you, should, you, you should keep an eye out for this game called Chicory. It's coming out in 2021. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? You're right, mate. You, you're, you're on cat. That's we how should... far ahead of the game he is. He knows we... about games on the PS7. <laughs> so now, we, now yeah, you may have been in caves where you can't go in caves, but now we can go in caves. So, you know, in just classic adventure game fashion, there's locked off areas, you gradually upgrade, and you can go to those areas. Oh, wait, wait, oh. go back. You, yeah, saw, no, you I spotted saw, it. I, saw, I got it. We have spotted, energy. we found the lost child. I think that's me got all of them, then. Um, oh, oh, game, game, hello. Yeah, so there's, there's little quests, like someone wants you to bring a beanie and a jacket to complete their outfit. Someone wants to bring their children who they've lost, and they don't want the child support to come get them. You know, just fun <laughs> stuff like that. The Yum Cave. Now, I believe there are little crystals knocking about that can actually help you. Yeah, like those crystals. I'm just going to cheat you. and do it this way. Yeah, I do that as well. Oh. Oh, crap. Love, Love the yum cave. Come on now. Play the game. Be sensible now. And I won't, I won't spoil too much, but you can pretty, you can tell it's pretty easy to kind of get through these areas. Um, Wait, is that something I can't get through? Oh, no. okay, 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 okay. You can use the mechanics to traverse the environment. Don't get it. And of course, there's things that can get rid of your paint that you have to try and deal with. There's stuff that can... You have to try and remove the light and deal with... Can I do things in the dark? Can I do things without paint? Etc. It uses it to Oh, look at well. that. It's like That's one satisfying. of those videos where they inject dye into people's blood vessels and <laughs> you can see it run right through their veins. You'll love that. Yeah, classic. Oh, a gift. I think I missed that when I went through. Get better at the game. Look what I've got. A cord coat. Hell, I've got no cord coat. Like a scum? Mud? Oh, you've got a cord coat now. Alright, so I want to go back to my custom tee and I'm going to get rid of my scarf so I can see it. Look I, at this guy! I, I also like that you can lock in the colours so you don't keep just recolouring yourself to colours you don't like. Um, that's a function. So yeah, of course you can customise yourself massively. Because um, why not? Yeah, why not? Just a daft wee game, innit? Got, got to have a... There's something to be said about games that just let you, let you do daft wee things. Exactly. Like, save the world. So, how do I approach this then? Um, you have to get round somehow. Um, I'll see that there's a little slope at the bottom, I believe. You can just see the, how it expands something else. Uh, 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 I'm trying to point out to you, but... Oh, oh, oh. yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Oh, there's I, one there, there's one there as well. I'm actually going to go and find another cord coat that you don't have. I've got the world's <laughs> largest collection of cord coats. <laughs> Just rub it in. There we go. I find like it occasionally gets stuck on edges a wee bit too much for my liking. Hmm. Um, but I, I presume that's to stop you just yeah, going so off on a... It's, it helps when you're colouring things in and you don't want to like... Yeah, sometimes you want to colour in the ground and you want to transfer into this lovely house painting that I've done. Yeah. Um, and, but there's future paint upgrades that you can get that make hell it yeah oh, representation I've got, <laughs> yeah, I got the glasses on as well oh can you not put a hat and glasses that's unrealistic glasses glasses is the only thing you 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 can wear the word you have to wear glasses and be bald 
true representation. All people want to see, do is wear glasses. These people. on the left here, they actually can't, they're actually, you can remove the paint, but it's the the crystals that are actually lighting up. So you have to try and get rid of the crystals, ah, and then they'll grow. But then you okay. can't see. So you have to try and balance sight and getting through. I'm just going to batter through this. Who needs light? Oh, I guess. Free gift. Free gift. <laughs> can't see shit, but you got a moon team. Nah, Ma Matthew, Matthew's better. It's got like a audible. It's, it looks like a radio. It. it looks like a radioactive logo. So that's what I thought it was. I was going for Sid from Toy Stories T-shirt. Oh, I, oh yeah. Okay, uh, fair. I got you. You that, that is representation. You are Sid from Toy Story. <laughs> Excuse me. All my toys <laughs> are left in the packaging. Uh, what are you? What are you being like? Yeah, you're by? the you're the collector from Toy Story. You have, to, you have to drive all the way to work on a Saturday, <laughs> all the way to work. <laughs> okay. Oh, did you draw that? I did. Oh not. no, you 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 must have gone to this other entrance. Oh yeah, I did. I yeah. did actually. Hell yeah. Now you're over here. Uh, so we've got gifts and stuff, and I believe there's there's other caves up north that you can go to, but we right now we have to take the brush back to Chikori. Chicory and apologize dearly for stealing it. Oh, I can't go there Robin her. Yeah, for we didn't actually go into her room and check if she was okay. She could have been like, well, we knocked. Um, absolutely sparkled out. <laughs> just like throttling at the mouth, having a horrendous <laughs> episode. And was like, well, I'm gonna, gonna just mug you and leave. Excellent. So let's go back up here. Oh, we can maybe this try is, and find the, the this kitties. This is um, Lemon, who didn't like the way I painted our house. Well, so. Only only yellow. Can't diversify a little bit. She's called Lemon? I thought that was... <laughs> <laughs> it's quite quite an assumption. I like how this is the first area you go into. You haven't painted one dot of it. <laughs> like, nah. Like... I, wanted to go, I wanted to go on with it, see what the game was. Just start speedrunning it. Oh, but on the top left, you've got some litter there you can collect. You can collect litter in the game because you should always collect litter, kids. Yeah, Same if you get a country, you can absolutely lob it out the out your window on the motorway at <laughs> seventy-five mile an hour. <laughs> we had different childhoods, it seems. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, this is a tangent, but I do I do hate littering. I can't I can't do it. I would rather have a pocket full of rotten eggs than to throw them in the throw it on the ground. There you go, chicory, a litter hater. Can I come in? I just want to give your brush back. Fine. Fine. Fine, boy. Me. Mood. <laughs> Me after all my E3 predictions don't come true. Bo Barnum presents and <laughs> <laughs> That one tickled me. <laughs> <laughs> God Get your fucking hands off! <laughs> oh man, welcome to the internet, right? Actually, forget it. You keep it. I can't take this from you. You're the wielder, the best one ever. I like Not to anymore. imagine that when it's written like that, in in the world. Uh, Pizza says a normal tone of voice, and then the words that are like shaking properly screams like hmm. face goes red, like eyes start laughing. <laughs> I like how the different characters have different kind of typefaces and fonts, so, and it's kind of like they're different accents. <laughs> As I've got, he's like, "Okay, okay, let's go." <laughs> I'll do it. That's fine. Goodbye. Oh, I love, I love pizza. Meet your hero. There you go. Pizza knows what it's all about. Hey. Stop that. Get fucking coloured, mate. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. Leave her leave, okay. leave, leave room alone. Hi. Oh, here I am. I'm in the game, by the way. I was looking for the wielder, but... Um, Do we think... I thought it was chicory. Is that a typeface? Or... No, it is, because those H's are the same. I was about to say... You thought I might have just been, like, messed up a little these. bit. They, yeah. look, they look kind of... Yeah, I think they might have been hand-drawn into a, a typeface. That seems like it yeah. could have been a thing. But it's very cute how it gives different characters kind of a little bit of character. Let's so, go and help this mouse out. So there's some creepy trees who are surrounding things. We will need to take the Nibble Tunnel to Potluck. <laughs> Love games. 
so I believe it's I know it's probably just a reading comprehension thing for me but I don't like when named places aren't capitalized even if it's like a wee a wee cutesy it's, style a wee aesthetic you can color in the thing. clouds I didn't even oh, know did you that. not know that I, yeah, know, you can... I didn't know you could color in the clouds what can I do on this canvas hee-haw you can hee-haw yeah um, you, can, you can go to the art academy I believe and they'll actually you might be able to get some of your paintings up there nah you're fine um Basil, Hi, Basil. Basil exposition. <laughs> yeah, we know this already, Basil. Basil, we're, we're... where were you? Where were you when I was running in circles well, with I, no idea what to do? I went to Basil first and then learned this, so um, clearly I don't, ah. haven't explored enough. Because you've been speedrunning trying to get a quick play in for Harry Mitchell. No, I, I went and spoke to the folk that told you how to. Wait, 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 wait. The you brushes, can... big and small. You can get rid of that. You can get rid of that. That plant and ah, traverse yes. and it's like find things and you can go up and it is like pokemon oh. oh and that's how you can get to the you can get to the cave up that way oh you can actually no i cannot why lie no you can you can go up the slope to the left where, where? You've, you've, you've gone down the slope go down up there and then get their plants back ah yes that Maybe. makes sense I thought it'd be a bit strange of them just to put this bit in for absolutely no discernible reason. Oh, now it's now, now the Nibble Tunnel, which I believe is oh. getting to potluck. We've got this as nice, everybody knows. This nice purple going on here. We've got dinners. Should have made the site purple. Um. Well, that. <laughs> don't bring this up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Didn't someone else have purple? Wasn't that the logic? Like IGN's red, Gamespot's orange. No, we, we we it was we were fine with either. We, it was overall was going to be purple or yellow, and we just you all wanted yellow. Um, yeah. And I was like, you know what? I'm fine with either. But purple is a nice color. I think it was Twitch had had purple, I guess. But ah, uh, yeah. Um, but you know what? Who else? Who else is yellow? Kotaku <laughs> mud. Um. So. Get rid of this. Yeah, yeah you get in it. You're getting yeah. it. Get, get on that. Bang. Bang. Absolutely twat it. But now, oh, is this thing up here? Oh no. Oh, oh that's, how you, that's a, how you get back down again. I nearly made a grave error there. That would have been terrible. That would have been game ending. That's like, if you don't if you do not do that, then... Ooh, what's the point? Oh, what's the point of these things? These are spooky. Ah! Yeah, they're spooky. So if you draw... If you draw over them, then they'll get rid of your paint. So you have to try and draw like around them a little bit. Or you can just keep going, but it'll... Just power through. That's how I did it before, oh. but... When in doubt, absolutely. Hell sprinted. yeah. Oh, black dress, hell yeah. Sexy, let's go. We've got a black, we've got a black dress, we've got glasses. We're looking great. There was, a, there was a time when I was having to get dressed properly, like respectably, to go into the BBC Studios for a couple of months. And I was like, I'm so boiling. It's always roasting in here. What can I do? And Laura Jane Grace of the band Against Me wears these really long black t-shirts. Please, like, please tell me you, this, this conversation is going to end and I, I wore a dress to the BBC Pacific Key. No, but this, this, is, this, is how, this is where it... Like, this was my thinking because she wears these really long black t-shirts that are like almost dress-like. And I was like, I bet you they let in so much air. And I looked into <laughs> it. Um, but the, I the looked ones, into it. <laughs> the ones she wears are uh, expensive, so it's like oh. Mark Zuckerberg. You know that the whole meme that has has like uniform is actually these like designer Italian t-shirts. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. The 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 the, the plain t-shirt and jeans are actually like Gucci shit because the world is horrible and everything is in pain. You ever hear about him specifically asking to get that Julius Caesar cut? You've got to respect it. Like people not. always thought he just had a terrible. I mean, I don't respect Mark Zuckerberg. He, is, oh. he did cause the downfall of Western civilization, but like he just thought he had a bad haircut, and then it was like, no, he actually wants to look like Caesar. <laughs> it's your da. It's he's, your da. He's a raccoon. I'm kidding. He's got, he's got good power to be fair. He's got great power, yeah. Um, sure. What do you want us to do? Put up a shelf. I want the holy shelf. Oh, you can use the touchpad. Ah, yeah, I, I mentioned that you can use a touchpad so you can. I thought that was only in co op, but I suppose that wouldn't really make sense. You both hold the same control. <laughs> no, yeah, the touchpads, this is one of the reasons why it's quite cool on PS5. Is the, the touchpad, I think, works quite well, actually. Um, what do you mean they may barely make time to talk to others? I spend my entire day with a Discord open. It's quite funny. What he's trying to say is that if you interact with them more, he'll give you something. 
um, uh. he was trying to say that you don't interact enough, and you went Tuh! and then ran away. <laughs> <laughs> Let's um, talk to Radish and Clementine, and then we'll, we'll wrap it. This is, this is your sister. Ah. And the be it. I'm so honoured to meet a famous... They've got... They've, they've shown sarcasm by floaty text, which uh, works quite well. They then just hand-draw the characters doing, like, the air quotes for absolutely everything they do. <laughs> That's how I show sarcasm subtly. Yeah, I just float... Your sister's kind of a vibe. She just like does art and is happy for you doing your stuff. Yeah. What, it, what is that? Is that her, her other ear tied behind her? her it doesn't make. No, it's sense. She's, she's got all of it. She's got a ponytail. It's kind of like tied back. Oh. There you go. So this is the, this is the art class I was talking about. How you just oh, okay absolutely poo yourself. Are you gonna? Well, I know how to draw Homer Simpson. Can we do that? <laughs> you could do that. I remember vividly one of the one of the original reasons I used YouTube was to learn was to look up how to draw the sunset. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh. now you can use those skills, and now you're kind of you're, you're kind of famous because you're now the the wielder. You're like the messiah of art. Oh, I'm, oh no, I'm panicking. This will be interesting. You get your brush styles ready. Brush styles. Exactly. What? What are those again? Raisin. Thank you, Raisin Exposition. You really should know this terminology by now. Why do we hear? Bad. That's been a bad teacher. You should never patronize. Why do we hear it from a special guest? <laughs> Pizza? Oh, haha. Well, it's. So, what's a brush style? Yeah. Be obtuse about it. <laughs> there we go. I, 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 I know what it is, but I don't believe if you know what it is. <laughs> I explained it fully because I wanted to flex. Um, there we go. So now we've got a starter set. So now, if you'll see, you can use hmm. your directional buttons to equip different types of brushes, such I as know, stars there, and there, hearts and X's and circles. There was a lot of chat before this game came out that this wasn't a, a JJM game, but I'm into it. I'm feeling it. Exactly. I think it's, 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 I think it's, it's what I need. It's just hard not to like, you know? Joy. Yes, and, you know, I didn't want things to become base because I thought this is a, a nice wee game and I didn't want to lower myself to <laughs> what is expected of me. Based? But since we're wrapping things up... Based on what? Sorry. <clears throat> oh, so oh, I see. I see. Oh, oh, oh the gangrene. Oh, go to a doctor. <laughs> Do not pass go. Oh, gangrene is bald. <laughs> That was a uh, uh, rejected site name, by the way. Wow. Well, it's just, it's a, it's, it's, a, it's an absolute chode. Um, Did didn't you? Aren't you on the box art for Eternal? Like, what? what when you given like an accolade for being a reviewer? No, I was on. The, I was in the trailer. Um, you're but... you're in the trailer for Returnal. You're front and center as the game's journalist opinion, and you're here, drawing a ball sack. Professional games critic. You can change, get your color change, mate. What's 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 a what's a, what's a helmet color? Oh, don't make it brown. <laughs> uh, it's just oh. after you put it in the shade. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan Midler. <laughs> <laughs> this is a lovely game. A lovely wholesome hashtag wholesome hashtag cozy game. You know you have to show it to the class, right? And they have to comment on it. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, wait, right. Man. Right, I wanna see I wanna hear what the comments are. <laughs> <laughs> Take a screenshot of that. <laughs> oh fucking hell. It feels so good to look at. The touch of dark orange red adds quite a bit. <laughs> you mean the shite? You mean the shite? Quinoa. Yeah, it's not the, the center, center is especially strong. Yeah, oh, thank you, Jesus. I like how you interpreted joy. My joy doesn't feel the same as this. All right, I mean, where should like, we swing, pal? Yeah, Reason. whatever you're into. <laughs> I feel like I really understand yours now. Hell yeah. Excuse me, does no one see how... Come on, comment on it. <laughs> that's, a, that's a dick. I want to take it home to... Excuse me? 
so many screenshots saved oh well that's it for now uh check on it is a fantastic game <laughs> i oh. love this so much oh i'm actually gonna play through this i'm gonna i was like i'm not gonna just ruin it and make every single <laughs> every single frame in this have some horrible thing drawn on it but, but every can, now and then you have, to, you, have, you have to treat yourself a little bit yeah um and the, uh, the devs anyway. know you want to do that i'm probably gonna get banned i, I, I hope that it's like the nintendo miiverse where everything that gets drawn gets <laughs> the devs, and they're like no perma ban <laughs> oh. oh jesus the, on the anyway. youtube on the youtube metadata we're marking this is not for kids sorry everyone <laughs> thanks Harry. thanks jordan Support for Overload is provided by our incredible patrons. To support us and receive access to perks and exclusives such as Patreon-only video series, check out patreon.com overload or click the link in the description. Thank you.